and breaking news coming in. Big breaking news from uh, neighboring Pakistan, where Anwar ul Haq Kakkar's name has been finalized as the caretaker prime minister. Senator Anwar ul Haq Kakkar from Balochistan is uh, to be the interim prime minister of Pakistan. Interim Pakistan uh, uh, Prime Minister is to be Anwar ul Haq. He is. Uh, he has been finalised uh, after uh, certain other names. Uh, um, certain other names were doing the rounds uh, since just a short while back, but now it's uh, Anwar ul Haq that will take over as Anwar ul Haq Kakar uh, is to be the interim Prime Minister of uh, Pakistan. Pakistan National Assembly was dissolved a short while back and uh, earlier the news was that Shahbaz Sharif uh, had begun consultations to appoint an interim park prime minister and uh, the name that has been decided upon is Anwar ul Haq of uh, Kakar of uh, Balochistan. He is a Pakistani politician who is an independent candidate on a general seat from Balochistan and uh, he had taken oath as a senator of, uh, uh, of, of the Pakistani National Assembly on the 12th of March 2018 and he co-launched a new political party, the Balochistan Awami Party. He's, uh, he will now be serving as uh, the caretaker prime minister of uh, Pakistan. Anwar ul Haq is the name that has been decided and he has been a member of the Senate of Pakistan since March 2018. And joining me now is uh, uh, on the broadcast is uh, senior editor, Republic senior editor Shawan Sen. Shawan, well, Anwar ul Haq is a uh, kakar, is to be the caretaker prime minister of uh, Pakistan. Uh, uh, he's been named as a caretaker prime minister. How big a surprise would you say this is? Because uh, till a short while back, the names that were doing the rounds were completely different. Well, in fact, an ultimatum of 12th of August was actually given. Remember, Shehbaz Sharif in an interview to a Pakistani news network had essentially indicated uh, that uh, in the days to come, in fact, his brother Nawaz Sharif would actually be in Pakistan. And perhaps in the run-up to the elections, it would essentially be Nawaz Sharif who's going to be the next face of the party. In fact, he has also stepped stepped down to be the deputy. As far as the caretaker is concerned, remember, Shahbaz Sharif had already said that in consultation with the leader of the opposition, that name would be taken. Now, the fact that you have uh, the caretaker prime minister being linked to, uh, to Balochistan is something... Uh, significant in Pakistan. How does this really pan out in the days to come is something that one will have to watch, wait and watch. Remember, all these decisions are something that the military has to be uh, taken into account. In fact, Shehbaz Sharif himself has admitted that his government perhaps could not have operated or could not have functioned without the support that came in uh, from the military. And that is one of the reasons why uh, having the stamp of, the pa of Pakistan's ISI, Pakistan Army, becomes extremely crucial. The next couple of months is going to be even more, perhaps, volatile in Pakistan. If at all, Nawaz Sharif returns to Pakistan, because remember, he still faces multiple cases. 